shutting the blinds, turning off all the lights, powering several fans, all in an effort to stay cool with no AC. But for two dogs, it was not enough. We gotta keep everything off. At Kimberly Brooks' home in the West Valley, we had to try to make it as dark. There's no light penetrating through the windows. Several fans keep the air circulating. Meanwhile, the thermostat's temperature is 99 degrees. Brooks says her air conditioning has been broken since July 18th, leaving her housebound in a hot house. And almost a week later, like my dog is gone because of this. He was breathing heavy, he was throwing up. So I tried to get him to an air condition, he passed away. Brooks says she wanted to prevent the dog's death, but could not find a way to merge the high cost of keeping her pet cool with her tight budget. I was like, I don't know what to do. I had to board my other dog. I spent over like over $1,000 just to try to keep everything cool. And Brooks isn't the only home renter telling Channel 13 of a similar dilemma. One of my dogs just died, came back from a hike, and he was just laid out on the carpet. Shanti's Hart, who lives in the Southwest, says her air conditioning unit for her rental home hasn't worked for two months. It's get anywhere from 86 to 96. And Hart raises three children and has another dog at the property. There's no way I should pay extremely high rent and I'm living in a place that's basically unhuman. According to Nevada Legal Services, air conditioning may be considered essential if the lease requires the landlord to provide it. And review of both Brooks and Hart's leases by Channel 13 show each has the provision. Channel 13 reached out to both property managements involved. Brooks Property Management Invitation Homes released a statement that reads in part, quote, As is our custom in situations such as this, we offered our resident a voucher to stay in a hotel until her AC is fixed. Americana Property Management, which manages Hart's rental home, told Channel 13 repairs to the air conditioning unit were completed on Friday and Hart now has a working AC. The two women both say they wish their pets were still alive. I'm used to seeing my dog running around, nothing. I'm Jay Won Jung reporting.